just wanted to show you guys we have a casualty over here but don't worry it's not anything bad it's just a matured male that has come to the end of his life yep mature males for those who don't know they don't live very long past their maturity so whoa wait wait what oh my he's he's actually still alive he's actually yo i thought he was dead oh my gosh okay all right yep that is that's i thought he was dead because that this was like a full death curl like oh my gosh what the heck okay i will give you a little bit of water so i don't know maybe you can rejuvenate yourself but usually when it's at this stage he is pretty much a goner but you never know so let me just put some water for you and maybe you can drink yep there we go <laughs> just drinking some water but yeah this matured male has already been matured for i would say close to a year so yeah he is definitely it's time for him to go but we'll just let him have some drink of water and yeah hopefully he will do better but yeah guys oh man i actually thought he was dead like what the heck okay by the way i have tried pairing this male with two females and just no luck he just didn't want to pair so yeah i guess i just left him in this container and no it is not a harpactera marxi this is actually the ceratogyrus sandery and it's kind of unfortunate that he didn't want to mate maybe he was infertile or something maybe he is infertile i don't know but yeah i guess he is coming to an end to his life so that is sad and yeah i have another mature male over here though this is my harpactera namakensis a very very nice big mature male but unfortunately i haven't got to find any female for him because they are a very rare species in the country so that's unfortunate but as for this guy <laughs> i have no idea like <sighs> you see he's actually have a sperm web over there he made a sperm web and he just even regardless, regardless of his sperm web, he just doesn't want to mate, which is so weird. He's been doing super well for months with just food every week. It's just now that he, I don't know, he just decided to do this and he seems a little bit thirsty. So maybe I should put in a bottle cap for him just in case. You never know. So let's do that. I'm just going to put in a bottle cap for you just in case you want to have a drink. Okay. And yeah let's see let's see he just ate like four days ago by the way i have no idea why he's just suddenly become like this okay let's pour some water in and hopefully you'll do well after this you want me to get you to the water come on you got this hey come on what are you doing oh my gosh come on oh oh whoa whoa i want to put you to the water dude what are you doing? There we go. To the water. Oh my. What is this guy even doing? Sorry about that random cut. Someone just decided to call me out of nowhere. Like, it was an unknown number. What the hell, man? I'm doing a video. Can you please not call me right now? Okay, so this tarantula. Come on. Come on. Oh, man. He, he just can't get up the water dish, can he? Yeah, he's definitely not doing very well and definitely in a death curl. It's okay. Why are you eating the substrate? All right, I'll just pour water onto the substrate just for you to drink. Yeah, there you go. Since you can't get to the water dish, I'll just put that over there. Wow, we actually came to a tarantula. We witnessed a tarantula in his uh, death curl on his verge of death. We will come back in a couple hours to see how he's doing. So guys, it is the next day and it appears that he is gone. Let me just check to be sure. I'm not too sure yet because remember yesterday when we checked, he actually started moving his legs. But yeah, guys, as you can see, he is, yep, he is 100% gone. Pretty much, we saw this tarantula. We witnessed him when he was right before his death and... What is that on his mouth? Is that like a little twig? Was he trying to eat that? I don't know, but there we go, guys. Mature males, they don't live very long. So that is 
what happens and you gotta expect this when you have a matured male because like I mentioned they don't live very long although some species they can live a couple of years after they mature but for these baboons like Ceratogyrus in particular they don't live very long a couple months maybe a year max and then they expire so yeah that's the quick update after a day he did not even come and drink his water so that was unfortunate and yeah you know, usually we just preserve tarantulas as a wet specimen. I put the tarantula in a glass container and put some alcohol in and just ignore that. I was cleaning my room earlier today. But yeah, today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. Something we haven't really done before on this channel. And that is I'm going to be cremating this tarantula, this matured male tarantula that passed away today. Now, it has been living with me for a long time. I've had it at a tiny sling. This was actually a a baby sandery that my male mated with another guy's female and then I've got the babies and this is one of the matured males so yeah I've had him for quite some time and he passed away he became a matured male like close to a year ago I think I can't quite remember but definitely more than six months so yeah now it is time for him to rest in peace and let's go cremate him all right so what i've got is this glass container over here and what i'm going to be doing is i am shredding this newspaper like peeling them into small pieces something like this and putting it inside and then we're going to put this guy on top like this there we go and then we're going to take some more and to just cover him up so that we can set this on fire and get him cremated with the newspaper. I've got a lighter over here which shoots out flames as you can see. Now let's go and cremate this guy. I'm going to be cremating him at the corner over here because I don't want to go out. So let's just put him, I don't know, yeah, uh, let's just put him here, okay? over here and you can still see his legs in there you can see if you look closely but yeah let's light this up and rest in peace dude rest in peace all right so there we go it's gonna go down all the way down catch on the other newspaper and have it all cremated nicely